Christy Pontanolia of FAS Bookkeeping and Tax Services. It's amazing to me how many small business owners don't know a real human at their bank. They set up the bank accounts online, do all of their banking virtually, and they never actually met someone. If this sounds like you, times are about to change. Get ready to establish a relationship with your banker. I experienced this firsthand during the PPP loan application. I have a personal banker assigned to me, but after we opened the business account, he just disappeared. I tried to contact him, but never returned my call or email. That is when I realized I have to find another bank that will take care of me and my business, especially during the time when we needed them the most. So I switched all my business checking account to a local bank and have a great client experience ever since. So first, identify who your banker is. If there's no one assigned to you, make sure you ask the bank to assign you one. You want to make sure that your business has a face and a name associated with it. Next, you're going to disclose all relevant information about your business with your banker, especially when it comes to cash flows. This is going to be critical so that your banker gets a clear understanding of exactly where you are in your business so they can assist you. Lastly, you're going to want to ask for options. Remember, there could be products or services that your bank offers that you simply don't know about. Having a relationship with your banker is a huge advantage during times of uncertainty. If you're not happy with your current banker, find another one that will demonstrate that they value your business and you can rely on them for support and attention. Thank you for watching. Again, I'm Christy Fontanilia of FAS Bookkeeping and Tax Services. And I'll see you next time.